A window washer at Newton Wellesley Hospital is recovering tonight after falling nearly 35 feet to the ground while working this afternoon. WBZ's Jim Smith is live for us in Newton tonight with the latest on that worker's condition. Jim? Well, Katie and Ken, this worker is expected to survive, but he has some really severe injuries, including a very badly broken leg. It was just before 2 o'clock Saturday afternoon. The window washer fell four stories between 30 and 40 feet while working outside Newton Wellesley Hospital. Police and fire crews rushed to the scene. He was on a, uh, a seated platform and he was over the side of the, uh, the edge of the building and he was down approximately 5 to 10 feet working on a window and his harness let go and he plummeted down. The individual is a 41-year-old male, sustained uh, severe leg injuries, non-life-threatening. He was transported to the Brigham Women. Rescue crews could not get to him right away because he was trapped in between two buildings. He was trapped in, in between two buildings and we couldn't get the ambulance close enough so we had to take the sh uh, scoop stretcher and carry him, you know, through a uh, garage and then out onto the driveway. So it was difficult um, getting evacuating him. OSHA is now investigating what went wrong. Cold and windy, and he was he was up uh, quite a ways in the building. He shouldn't been out, he shouldn't been out there this afternoon. No. Obviously, very frightening situation for that worker. But once again, the injuries described as not life threatening. He was taken to Brigham and Women's Hospital. Live in Newton, Jim Smith, WBZ News. All right, Jim.